Hello and welcome to the iOS 5 how to download video from STR. You're going to want to start by opening iTunes and going to your device and click check for update. Now once you check for update it will ask you if you want to just download it or downlo download and update. You're going to want to click download and update and then this window will come up. And this process takes about 15 minutes but we speed it up for you um, so we don't waste your time. Now after the download is finished it will prepare to back up your iPod or iTouch or whatever. Now after the preparation is finished, the backing up takes about 30 to 45 minutes. So we'll kind of skip most of that for you here. Now, now that it's finished backing up, it'll start extracting the software and your iPod will actually turn off when the extraction is finished. And this is when the actual update begins. Now on your iPod you'll get this black Apple logo and then underneath that it'll have, a stat it'll have a status bar for the update. Then you have to connect it to iTunes which you'll already have connected and it'll be restoring your apps. Uh, it starts with apps then it goes to music and videos and whatnot. but while you're restoring you can actually begin setting up your iPod for iOS 5. Now first is location services, turn that on. Then set up your Wi-Fi networks if you have any. Then put your Apple ID in. Then you agree to the terms and conditions of iOS 5, that'll register. You set up the iCloud, and if you want to use iCloud, press that. And so you want to merge iCloud with your computer. Um, then you want to put Find My iTouch. If you lose it, it's a great thing to have, Find My iTouch. This is for diagnostics sent to Apple. You can say yes or no. Then you can start using your iPod, and it'll ask you if you want to set a passcode, and if you do, you can type it in right there. This is the screen. It looks about the same. Newsstand, you can go to the store. Mes iMessage, you can set up right away. Just put in your Apple ID. It'll verify you, and then you can put in a region for your location. And also, settings has changed. You can, um, the buttons look different. Now, it'll be preparing your apps to sync, and after it's restored, it'll sync everything back up. Now, you'll notice that when, while after you've set up your iPod you won't have any songs or apps or videos there this is what happens because after the restore is finished there's a sync which puts everything back on your iPod and your high scores for your games will be there your play counts for your songs will be there everything now this takes a while again depending on how much stuff you have on your iPod so we'll speed this up for you it copies all your apps all your videos all your songs onto your iPod and after it's all finished, there you go. You're all finished and you're able to use iOS 5 freely. So this has been STR, how to download iOS 5. We'll have reviews and um, uh, introductions to the new features soon. Like us on Facebook, subscribe, and please comment. Thank you for watching.